Welcome to Easy A Homeschool Academy. Today, we will learn about blizzards. What is a blizzard? A blizzard is a natural occurrence. It describes a very powerful and severe snowstorm. For a snowstorm to be considered a blizzard, it must have very powerful winds, low temperatures, and a lot of blowing snow. How are blizzards formed? For a blizzard to form, there has to be key elements. The air in the clouds must be below the freezing point to allow for the formation of snowflakes. The air on the ground must also be below the freezing point. Moisture in the air, known as water vapor, is also important. When wind blows across large bodies of water, it picks up a lot of water vapor, which contributes to the formation of a blizzard. Finally, there has to be a time when warm air meets cold air. This combination of air of differing temperatures helps to create the occurrence of a blizzard. When and where do blizzards form? Blizzards are winter storms and they can happen anywhere that it snows. However, they seem to happen more prevalently in the northeastern region of the United States and in the provinces of Canada. Blizzard Features There are key features to keep in mind when determining if a snowstorm is in fact a blizzard. First, there has to be sustained wind speeds of 35 miles per hour or 56 kilometers per hour or greater for at least three hours. As mentioned before, blowing snow is also a characteristic of a blizzard. The snow blowing around reduces our ability to see very far. Blizzards reduce our visibility to approximately one quarter of a mile or 0.4 kilometers or less. When visibility becomes so low, driving conditions will become increasingly more dangerous. Blizzards also occur with very low temperatures. Temperatures can drop below 10 degrees Fahrenheit or at negative 12 degrees Celsius. Consequences of a blizzard. When blizzard conditions occur, roads and transportation systems may be affected. Whiteout conditions occur when a severe blizzard becomes so dangerous that it is difficult to see where the ground ends and the air begins. This presents a greater challenge for anyone trying to move around outside. People often lose their sense of direction when operating a motor vehicle or aircraft and accidents may happen. Blizzard conditions can have devastating effects. Lack of access to food or medical care can leave long-term damages for anyone trapped by the copious amounts of snow associated with blizzards. Extreme temperatures can lead to hypothermia and loss of life. Extreme temperatures can also affect machinery and electronics necessary for the daily operation of our communities. What can be done to prevent a blizzard? As with other natural occurrences, a blizzard cannot be prevented. People living in blizzard-prone regions can however prepare for a blizzard should one occur. Meteorologists and other weather specialists will issue a blizzard watch if they have predicted weather conditions that may lead to a blizzard. In this case, people are encouraged to stay indoors with emergency supplies like food, water, and medical supplies. Blizzards can have serious consequences. The strong winds, extremely cold temperatures, and the snow blowing around can lead to the accumulation of snow, which can lead to loss of lives. 
being aware of their causes and effects on the environment is one way to be prepared in the event of a blizzard happening in your area. I hope you learned something about blizzards today. Thank you for taking this learning journey with me. Until next time. As always, thank you for watching. Tell us what you want to see next. Email EZA Homeschool Academy at yahoo.com. Like and share our videos. Please subscribe to our channel.